When it comes to developing a beverage, the sweetener is arguably the most important consideration. In the beginning, there was sugar, and by sugar we are referring to the refined, sweet, white crystals you see on diner counters across America. Sugar is the benchmark of sweetness, and all other sweeteners are measured against its taste and sweetness level. But over the years, other sweeteners have risen in popularity as well. So how do you know which to choose for your beverage? Let's talk calories. Using caloric sweeteners will add calories to your beverage, and you might want to be mindful of just how many are added. Sugar is a carbohydrate and has four calories per gram. Not bad, right? But keep in mind there are around 40 grams of sugar in the average soft drink. High fructose corn syrup is a liquid form of sugar derived from corn. HFCS is relatively the same sweetness, similar in caloric content, and, depending on the market, tends to be less expensive than sugar, which makes it a popular choice. Now, let's say you want to go a more natural route. Raw sugar is sugar from cane that has been minimally processed. It is brown in color and has the same caloric content as refined sugar, but because of its raw nature, it tends to contain particulates, such as bits of cane, that will show up in your beverage giving it that earthy street cred. Agave syrup comes from the agave plant, which is also used to make tequila. Agave syrup is less sweet than sugar and more expensive, meaning it costs more to achieve the sweetness level sugar would give. In addition, agave syrup can impart its brown color and distinct flavor into your beverage depending on the amount used. Then there are sugar alcohols. No, not that kind of alcohol. Sugar alcohols like xylitol and erythritol are naturally occurring alcohols found in certain fruits and woods. They generally have a third less calories than sugar, a lower sweetness level, but at a higher cost. Plus, in high enough quantities, they can have a laxative effect, and nobody wants that. But let's say you don't want all the calories in your beverage. Non-caloric sweeteners commonly associated with the blue, pink, and yellow package you see at restaurants actually do have calories, but because their relative sweetness levels are so much higher than sugar, very little is needed to sweeten your beverage. For instance, sucralose is a high-intensity artificial sweetener that is 600 times sweeter than sugar. That means that one gram of sucralose is equal to 600 grams of sugar. Mind still not blown? Well, brace yourself for this one. One gram of sucralose can sweeten 15 cans of soda with zero calories. Compared to an average of 180 calories per can of sugar-sweetened soda, the math is mathematical. Stevia is considered a natural non-caloric sweetener option that is about 200 times sweeter than sugar, but costs more and some consumers associate it with a bitter aftertaste. Many non-caloric sweeteners can impart an aftertaste into the beverage and have a thinner mouthfeel than sugar. It is not uncommon to blend caloric sweeteners with non-caloric sweeteners to maximize taste while minimizing calories. Now you know, unlike men, not all sweeteners are created equal. And that is your 60 seconds of sip science with a sweet two minutes of bonus footage.